Good afternoon, Mr. Mill, and thank you so much for being here. Could you explain a little bit to us about the game of today, please? Well, today was a rather complex game. Uh, I played with Badu Jabawa, and he opted for a rare provocative line as black. And, well, I was tempted to to be provoked, and I went forward. Uh, the game was very complex, and uh, objectively it was about equality all the time. Uh, but very, very complex. Of course, we spent a lot of time, and although the game was short in terms of moves, only 21 moves, we played for more than four hours. And uh, basically, Badur made only one mistake, but it was enough because the position was very complex. And uh, he played rook f8, missing e6, and uh, rook g8, played, 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 missing f e6. e6 is a beautiful move, and it's also very strong. And after that, the white's attack is irresistible. Uh, a question and also an answer for all chess amateurs from around the world. How you organize yourself in a complex positions, cal uh, calculating so many moves, and how you organize the time pressure and, and everything in, in complex positions? Well, it's not easy to give an answer, and specifically for the reasons that in recent years I haven't been handling it as good as I used to. Let's say when I was 20 or 25, or uh, I played these positions better. Still, sometimes I managed, uh, but uh, it's it's uh, too complex matter to, to to describe in in a couple of words. Basically, it comes also with with your experience and knowing the patterns, which is very important, of course. And of course, you've got to have good good intuition for that because some positions you just cannot calculate till the end, so you you rely on your intuition. Perfect. And finally, like question and also an answer for organizers around the world. Uh, what do you think it has to be changed in tournament to attract more chess players as a spectators and also non chess players to see like chess as a show? Well, it's it's difficult question. First of all, we have to decide whether we need to see chess as a show or to remain in our niche, which is also quite an approach. Uh, here we, we try for the second time as ACP president. I was happy to continue this tradition which we started in 2012 with uh, longer games, with a time control which will allow more time to be dedicated for the game and possibly adjourned games. Which is something resembling good old times. Uh, you can vary different formats, but I do not think that in, in any format you can compete with football or whatever. So I'm not sure we really have to strive to it. We have to, to, to try different formats, and this format is, is actually unique, it has been only played under the ACP Golden Classic format. And uh, I think people quite like it and it is quite attractive. Perfect, then thank you so much. Okay.